Not a lot of people talk about how hard it is to get sleep when you're trying to run your own 3D printing business. When you have something on the plate that might be a little complicated and you're afraid that something might go wrong at any one point because now your livelihood relies on its success. So one of the very first investments I made was an upgrade to the camera to the stock Bamboo P1S because the camera stock sucks. It moves like half a frame a second. And truthfully, any camera whatsoever, even the one that kind of sucks, is better than having no camera at all, which was my previous setup, the Creality CR10, a couple years back. Because if something does fail, you want to know where it failed so you could tweak your designs. It's cool. This design, I even have clearance to uh, open and close the door without any issues if I just tilt the camera up. I'll include a link in the description if I can for the original YouTube video I saw where the guy was talking about using this Tapo camera and also to the STL file where it's free. Um, you could download this and you could put it on your P1S. You can pay for cloud storage, but this app is free. The camera itself, I think, was less than 30 bucks on Amazon. So this is the stock camera on the Bamboo Handy app. And this is the camera using the Tapo C100.